Hey everybody, welcome to the video. I just wanted to make a video to say to let go of the feeling and the idea and focusing on that you're, that you're missing something in life. Let go of the feeling that you're missing something in life. Let go of the, the, the idea and the thoughts and the feeling that you're missing something in life. That there's something wrong with you, that you're missing something, there's something you're not getting. You need something, you just don't have it. This like, there are many people who are seekers and not havers. We're all not havers. There's always something along the human experience that we don't have, that we want. But when you solidify this as part of your vibration, your energy field, your aura, your, your whole being, you're living in a state of lack, you're living in a state of feeling missing something all of the time. So this isn't a nice feeling to have and it, it, it affects our quality of life. It gets in the way of the truth of what we have. There's so much of what we have. We all have so many things. There's endless things to feel appreciation for, the ground beneath your feet. How grateful for you for that. Imagine we didn't have the ground beneath our feet our feet we were dangling or falling we're secure with the ground beneath our feet it's mother earth and it's a blessing we have our, our feet our legs our arms our eyes our hands many people have gotten frostbitten which is where your fingers or your extremities actually become solid ice becomes frozen and then it dies and you have to get them removed some people are blind some people are homeless or starving or hungry or fearful or in great pain and discomfort even surviving and struggling for their life we have so much comfort here being on the internet and in our home and having our body there are so many things for us to be grateful for in our life the money we have in our home our family and parents think of the people who are still alive in your life they will die and so will you but you'll still live on so it's not really death it's just change but why not appreciate what we have here while we have it before it's gone imagine like yourself in 20 years time now imagine your parents or whoever it is your loved ones your best friend your partner imagine they're some imagine they're dead now okay imagine in 20 years that they're dead if you could look back in 20 years time to now knowing that they're still alive how would you treat them differently and what would you do that's different this is like gives me a shiver because it's just so powerful and real and truthful and when you just realize this you can let it transform and change your life and to change yourself and to be a different person to be a nicer person a kinder person more compassionate person to just be more generous and present with lo in love and appreciation for the people that you have still. So life is a ride, it's a roller coaster, it's an up and a down. <sighs> we may as well make the most of today and always and look back today, look back at the end of it instead of at the end of your life, look back at the end of today and see if you've lived a good life. So you're gonna look back at the end of your life anyway but how about you look back at the end of your day like a miniature life and see was it fulfilling was it worthwhile did you live it worthwhile or meaningful did you help others were you kind were you generous did you do something helpful to somebody else productive considerate thoughtful caring to another person or people or an animal or plants even so Find, do what you find fulfilling and meaningful during your day as well as fun and exciting and entertaining, enjoyable. Let go of the feeling, the idea, the concentration and focus and attention you have on that there's something missing in your life. And, and let in feeling gratitude, love and appreciation which are basically all the same more or less, close, very close
okay so let's say you feel like this emptiness that you're missing a partner or girlfriend a boyfriend a partner or money or health or or something let go of the absence focus and concentration okay and think of everything else that you have and think of the positives about this aspect too and then from here start to let in and allow and accept let in and allow feeling good into yourself and into your life and then from here from this place that's when you can start to attract and manifest and let in and allow in and bring in and adopt in and create in open up to the universe giving you and you being ready to accept and embrace and collect and gather <laughs> what you want too you know so you 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 bring in and accept all of these other beautiful things from every other aspect of your life but including will also be the readiness and willingness and ability to take accept and collect what you this thing that you're previously feeling missing and a sense of absence for because you're celebrating life now you're in the mode the energy the vibration of appreciation love and gratitude joy celebration presence being there in all of this realization and feeling good mode and then if you have any problem or issue you'll see it clearly you can think clearly feel clearly the energy's flowing there's no obstructions or blockages or else much less and then 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 you get to get what you previously wanted but not because you really desperately need it anymore but because it's good for you and you want it and it's healthy and it's happy and it's balanced so just keep to do what you want in life keep doing what you love and passionate about make your life meaningful fulfilling remember and do what you find enjoyable and helpful of service kind friendly exciting intriguing so instead of going to college something you don't even like because you're peer pressured by society instead keep adopting in and anybody can do this more and more of what you're really truly heartfelt inspired towards and inclined and drawn towards and then you love it and you live your life and your purpose so much more so you're always living your purpose by the way no matter where you are don't worry about that so good day to you and I bid you I bid you farewell and thanks for your company and your time we're brothers and sisters of this world this universe this globe this beautiful spherical planet I haven't measured it like perfectly myself to make sure it's a perfect sphere <laughs> I guess the big mountains can like take away the perfect sphere aspect of it eh? bumping in okay so I'll see you again another time and check out my links below the video um, a link as well for my products my my, my, my herb and superfood health shop um, how to make a living online ethically and and helping others and very effectively just many millionaires make a very very good living maybe get rich and use that money to help the planet and ourselves and our loved ones and other people together you know to co-create and just have a quick look below you know there's so many good things and good luck in your co-creations and thanks for doing your part and your thing and joining me in this lovely video so Thanks again and I'll see you again another time so feel welcome to leave any comments or questions below and maybe let me know if I can be of any more service. I I, I do want to win coaching at the moment so any anything at all like just drop us a line and I'll be happy to hear from you. Okay. Bye. Have a good day. See ya. Where are we? We're here we are in my backyard in Ireland. <laughs> Thank Mother Nature. <laughs>